Martin family is making Kindness Day an annual celebration of giving back to their community. And News Channel 8's Mary McGuire has their heartwarming story. Kindness Day has a special meaning for lots of families across Tampa Bay, especially for one mom and her two daughters who have come here for the past six years. Donating toys, teddy bears, food, and blood is a tradition every year for many people across Tampa Bay. But Kindness Day means something extra special for Beth DeMeo and her two daughters. It's become a kind of tradition for us. It's a fun day for us to give back. Beth and her girls first dropped off toys in 2010 when Sophia was just two years old and Olivia was still in Beth's tummy. Sophia turned eight in August, but instead of spending her birthday money on herself, she decided to save it, buying $100 worth of toys to donate to kids who need them. You could have gone out and bought something for yourself. Why, why do something for other kids? Because they don't have as much as we do and they need to have something for Christmas too. Just five and eight years old, these two little girls already know the true meaning of Kindness Day to think of others before themselves. It's a sentiment that is celebrated today and every day at the DeMeo household. Not everybody knows, especially children, how good it feels to receive, but they also don't always know how good it feels to give. And if that just becomes part of their daily life, they won't even think twice about it. After making their donations here at Kindness Day, the DeMeos will head on over to St. Joseph's Hospital where they will pass out angel baskets. Reporting in Tampa, I'm Mary McGuire, News Channel 8.